Okay, I want to ask you, how many of you are attending a comedy show for the very first time here? Yeah, oh my god. So you guys are like losing your virginity with us. <laughs> it's an honor, sir. And you guys are sitting like virgins also. <laughs> you guys are, like, you know, like, let him do all the work. <laughs> <laughs> I want to finish this and tell my friends, I did it, I did it, I did it. <laughs> Last year, uh, like uh, both my exes got married, so it was a great year for me. Like one of them got COVID also, it's like, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> the one of the girl I was dating, we were actually, we actually started dating during the lockdown. Yeah, so technically I was going through two pandemics. <laughs> yeah, and you know what's funny? Same symptoms, headache. <laughs> Body pain. Worst case, diarrhea. Like. <laughs> Happened. We broke up though. We broke up. She dumped me. She dumped me because she told me, Anand, I'm dumping you because you give more importance to your best friend. You know, you give, you prioritize your best friend more. That's why I'm dumping you. Yeah, best friend, best friend. And then she got married to her best friend. <laughs> I was like, uh, do you see the irony here? <laughs> like, I give my friend important, but you have given him the ultimate importance. <laughs> Like, you know, I I like my best friend. He's a nice guy. But I never walked up to him and like, Macha. <laughs> you know I like you, right? <laughs> but yeah, I don't want to shit on her like this, some crazy ex-boyfriend and all. I know, she was a nice person. Like, asshole, but good human being. <laughs> you know that variety. <laughs> 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 uh, <laughs> but the, here's the thing. This is more about me, okay? So whenever I start dating someone or I get into a relationship with someone, in the beginning, I'm as fake as possible. Yeah, because I don't want her to leave. You know, let her fall in love completely and then I'll show what an asshole I am. The day she tells me, Anand, I don't think so I can live without you. I'm like, it's time for the psycho. <laughs> and uh, my idea of being fake is uh, being macho. Have you ever seen those macho guys? <laughs> See those guys, right? They'll be walking and suddenly for no reason they'll do this. <laughs> Why are you stretching? We're going to the chai shop, no? Really have to stretch? <laughs> I think the most macho thing I did in front of her was when she was talking to me, I did this. <laughs> but this is the funny part. You know why? Because none of my muscles cracked. <laughs> So it was a very quiet, ah! <laughs> So I, and the whole reason why I want to do this is because I wanted to think I'm a macho guy. You know, I wanted to think if any problem, my boyfriend will protect me. You know, the truth is if there is a problem, I'll use her to protect me. <laughs> like, I don't give a shit, I'm a pussy, I know. Like, you know, if I'm ever getting robbed and all, I'll be like, sir, actually take her wallet, there's more money in it. <laughs> Five minutes back only she went to the ATM. <laughs> So to prove I'm a macho dude, what I did was the other day the gas cylinder guy came. <laughs> so I picked up the cylinder in front of her and I walked around with an empty gas cylinder. <laughs> you know that walk, right? <laughs> the most non-macho walk ever. When you do that, you look like a Paralympic athlete. You know, I have dreams. <laughs> and the thing is, like, even when I did it, even the fucking gas cylinder guy was like, Phew. <laughs> at least do to the new one. <laughs> Kept it there and she was like, mm, like she made that face. Mm. I was like, oh, it's working. She thinks I'm macho. <laughs> two months into the dating, we're drinking at one of my friend's place. And at two in the night, this guy challenges her, my girlfriend for a push-up competition. Because that's how men are. <laughs> you know, once you get drunk, logic says good night. <laughs> logic is like, bro, I'm booking Uber. <laughs> and I thought she'll say, fuck off, dude, I'm not interested. You know what she said? Bring it on. <laughs> That's when I realized I'm dating an idiot as well. <laughs> and she's doing push-up. I knew she was going to lose. He's going to kick her ass. And I know I assumed it was wrong of mine because she proved me wrong. Because she did 41 push-ups. Because literally there were two voices in my head. Impressed and terrified. One was like, dude, she's your girlfriend. The other like, she's your fucking girlfriend. <laughs> it's not even like she did 41. She was like, nothing. She chucked the drink and she lit a smoke. <laughs> I was like, are you a raw agent? 
Is that why you're dating me? So nobody suspects you. No, you can lay low. A king. All this while I thought I'm dating this cute girl. I didn't know I was dating one of the Dangal sisters. That day I changed her nickname. From baby she became Gitta Babita. Yeah, I used to fuck with her also. There was this one time we were about to do it. I just looked at the bed. I'm like, ये तो राखड़ा है. और माने तो गोल्ड मेडल ची. Oh, that night, slept on the couch. <laughs> so nicely. <laughs> But yeah, that got over now. Now, now this is a funny story. Something else is happening in my life. I like this girl again. I really do. But uh, the problem is, she's too pretty for me. Like even I know. But you know how pretty she is. Even a class exam, if you put her photo and my photo in two different columns, no kid will match the following. <laughs> If prettiness was an office, see your reception desk. <laughs> That's the graph. But here's the thing: she's fucked up. Yeah, she's very insecure. Has that all those body issues, confidence issues, all that kind of stuff. And that's why she hangs out with me. <laughs> I know. I am sorted. I know she can do better. She doesn't. And this is the first time in my life I am happy that someone is fucked up. <laughs> Otherwise, they wouldn't hang out with me. I know it's statistic. I know it is like her delusion is my dreamland. <laughs> the more she looks in the mirror and she goes, "I suck, I suck," I am like, "Anand, you rock. <laughs> you are a fucking nine, Anand. You are a nine. <laughs> I am. Like, I can't help it. She's too beautiful. You know how beautiful she is. The other day, she video called me. She was pretty on low data. <laughs> On low data, my face looks like a dick from Japanese porn. <laughs> it is true. Like we have some of, like some of us are ugly. We need to agree that. Like I have some ugly friends. When they video call me, it looks like I'm talking to an ultrasound report. <laughs> so it like, like here you can see the head. <laughs> uh, that's the thing. Like and, and I have finally understood. Like you know, she, I know she's fucked up, but you have to understand. Someone else's loss is your gain. <laughs> That's how life works. <laughs> like, have you guys ever noticed? Whenever there's a storm or flood in Chennai, the weather in Bangalore is fucking amazing. <laughs> That's how life works, okay? Like, kilometers away, people are drowning. I am standing on the balcony, going, "Agar old man ko thana." Kya feel aa jati? You should not hear this story from her perspective. Then it's a tragedy. <laughs> But you hear it from my perspective. It's a Disney movie. Yeah, I'm Aladdin. She's Jasmine. And you know what's my genie? Her insecurity. <laughs> Every time she's like, I feel confident today. I'm like, But what about your looks? <laughs> Do you think your last relationship was good? <laughs> it is the truth. Like I'm telling you. But and by the way, I have to confess something to you guys. I am as shocked as anyone. That she hangs out with me. I also look in the mirror like it's real, Anand. It's real. <laughs> Pinch you. Yeah, it's real. It's real. It is real. Like when, like when she video called me, she said, like, do you want to catch up for a coffee? I like, do you? <laughs> Are you sure? Do I owe you money? Where is the camera? <laughs> This is Chupa Rustam, right? I know. I don't believe it. Like we met on the date, our first date. She took a selfie with me. I'm like, you want to document this shit? <laughs> What is wrong with you? And there's a funny part. Okay, since the time I've started hanging out with her, the amount of respect I'm getting from my friends <laughs> has gone higher. Yeah, my friends look at me like Anand, you have something. <laughs> Anand, you have some power. And I'm like, huh? <laughs> What power? Ah, <laughs> I have something. It is true. Like a couple of days back, I was dreaming with my friends, and they saw that photograph. They saw that photograph because it's my wallpaper now. <laughs> And here's the thing. One guy saw that photograph. He went crazy, dude. He got a match on Tinder. He gave me his phone. He's like, "Anand, you talk. You can convert faster." Anand, you have something. <laughs> And I don't know what to say. I went like, "Hey, do you believe in God?" Because that's what's happening to me. Is <laughs> it? It's almost like the amount of you know those. Have you ever seen in those like city like those shitty houses 
in the center of the city but their land value is really high because they're right next to a mall <laughs> i am that shitty house <laughs> i know like people look at me like look at that shit and i'm like but what about this mall <laughs> <laughs> look at the jawline of this mall <laughs> <laughs> right, and I remember this. Okay, when I used to be like very like single and all. I don't know what is that term, very single. But you understand, <laughs> I was very single. If I ever looked like a pretty, looked at a pretty girl with an average looking guy, I used to cuss that couple <laughs> from my heart. <laughs> you know, like that. Have you ever done that? When I've seen a like a really pretty girl with an average looking guy, I think most men have done this. Why him? <laughs> <laughs> all have done that shit. <laughs> No, by him. <laughs> and the funny part is now when I am that guy, I love the attention. <laughs> love it. <laughs> I see like guys looking at me from across the street, like you piece of shit. I'm like, yeah. <laughs> I know, right? <laughs> you didn't think. I know. <laughs>